earlier. Yeah, this woman is amazing. She moved to Philadelphia. Well, what, kind, what kind of a dream? She mm -hmm. wanted to make it big in a business that's dominated by men, professional yes. wrestling. Right. Fox 29's John Anderson, he talked to her, loved her. Take a look. Slam. It's a peaceful walk to the gym in South Philadelphia for Sarah Del Rey. But when she unlocks the door, it's anything but peaceful inside the arena. Inside, Sarah Del Rey becomes Sarah Death Ray. In the pro wrestling world, wrestling has been her ticket to the world. She has competed in Japan, Germany, and Australia, to name a few. She says women's wrestling is bigger and more respected in those countries. In Japan and Mexico, it's just, they're, the women especially are just looked at like any other athlete, which is amazing. Nine years ago, Sarah left Northern California for a chance to hit the mats in Philadelphia. While other little girls were dreaming of rock stars and heartthrobs, Sarah used to idolize so what you gonna do? Hulk Hogan. I was always a tomboy, so watching it as a kid, like just the big personalities and like the superstars were just amazing to me. I got a little too involved in the storylines and my mom made me stop watching at a young age, but then when I got old enough to handle it, I got back into it. Yeah. Yeah. Sarah trains five hours a day, many of those hours with her tag team partner Emily. When asked if wrestling is fake or even a sport, Sarah says it's an exhibition and it's physical. She's had several injuries to prove it, including dislocated shoulders and kneecaps. And broken toes and fingers, all that kind of stuff, black eyes. Guys, if you still have doubts, Sarah invites you to join her in the ring. In South Philadelphia, John Anderson, Fox 29 News. Sarah, in your face. Wow, <laughs> Sarah. Was... And how about the other woman? The woman. See her arms? Fit. Fit. Gun show. Hey, if you want to go see their show, 7 West Rittner Street, South Philadelphia. The matches are tonight and Saturday night. And Sunday afternoon. Get a little Sunday matinee action going on. Yeah, go to church and then go over there Sunday afternoon. <laughs>